cheese straws. I'm Arthur, king of the earth, king of the sky. Oh, whoops. Oh, right. <laughs> oh, <man. laughs> I'll go. <laughs> Beautiful thing I've ever seen. Angelina! Shh. Oh, wow! Oh. He's beautiful. I wonder why he's shaking. Shaking? Oh dear. It's his leg. I, I think it's broken. Oh, just look at those wonderful wings. Ah, poor little poop chick. Can I hold him, Angelina? No, Henry. Can't you see he's hurt? Oh. Don't worry. I'll take you home and look after you. Does he have a name? Uh, um, uh, Arthur. There you go. Perfect place for Arthur to live in until he gets better. Thanks, Dad. Can I put him in the jar, Angelina? Please, can I? No, Henry. What if you broke one of his other legs? Oh. Careful, does it? There we go. Right, now you need to make some air holes so that Arthur can breathe. Oh, I'll do it, I'll do it. No, Henry, you will not. Oh. I bet he must be starving. Hmm. I wonder what butterflies like to eat. Flowers. It says here that butterflies sip nectar from lots of different types of flowers. What's nectar? It's a kind of sweet sugary juice. Oh, maybe he'd like a lick of this. Don't be silly, Henry. Oh, Arthur. I'm going to find you the sweetest rose in the world. Please, can I hold him, Angelina? Please? Henry, no! <sighs> there's his pillow, and there's his swing. I wonder what he'll need next. Lots of sunshine and plenty of freedom. A slide! He'd love a slide! Hmm. <sighs> I expect he'll be ready to go home soon. I mean, his legs are all better now. He doesn't even have a limp. Yes, but he's still very ill, Alice. He can't even fly yet. Oh! Oh! Look! Yeah, he's flying! <gasps> Arthur's really, really flying! <laughs> oh, oh! It's like he's dancing! Angelina. What if he hurts himself again? It's very dangerous out there. Oh, he does look sad. Maybe he doesn't like living in there. Rubbish! He loves it. Don't you, Arthur? This is your home until you're totally better. Which probably won't be for years. Time for lunch! Oh! Oh! Goody!
Do you buy Jung Bao Slig? Uh, oh. <sighs> Angelina, please don't. It's no use. I'll never see Arthur again. Never. Well, maybe he's gone home. <gasps> yes. find them soon. They couldn't have gone far. Right, you three, follow me. And, and you must search to the right, and you to the left. Uh, 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 ow! Go oh, away! Uh, Arthur? No, Alice, it's me, William. Look, it's Arthur. I, I think he's trying to tell us something. Do we have here? My darlings, don't worry. I am here. Catch, Henry. Oh. <laughs> Arthur didn't even come to say goodbye. Henry, being 
trapped is awful. For Arthur to be really happy, he needs to be free. Oh! Oh, look! making the earth warm and light, seeing everything that's happening in the world. Being a dancer means you can be anything you want, like... like Arthur the butterfly. Butterflies are so light they can balance on the tiniest flower and not bend it. And they're very quiet. You can hardly hear them fluttering their wings. It's very difficult to pretend to be so delicate. Or oh, you can be a cat. Even though cats are much bigger than butterflies, they're very light on their feet. And they're really good at jumping. Most of the time. <gasps> what are Scarlet and Caitlin doing? I know! It's the pas de chat. That means cat-like steps. Toby and Hamish are being now. Something big and heavy. <gasps> oh, there's Scarlet! And she's got a trunk! And a tail! Trunks and tails! And they make the ground shake when they walk. I know! They're being elephants! These aren't elephant feet. Oh, it's the sunbeams again. If I could dance anything in the world, I'd be a sunbeam. Because sunbeams can see the butterflies and the cats and the elephants. I'd love to be the sun queen like Caitlin. I wonder what it feels like to be a queen, wearing a crown with everyone kneeling to you. <laughs> 